Hello everyone, welcome to another video for Philips Tecon DDS CAD. When designing security systems, the analysis of blind spots are highly important. Let's see how it works in DDS CAD. Enjoy! The motion detectors for security systems come with a range area, as we can see here in this picture preview. But when inserted in a model, this is only visible in the space where it is inserted. So I will insert this symbol here in this corner and uh, we can see here this range area filling only this space. But we can see there is a blind spot. But to analyze it, I will make use of helplines. Okay, so I will start this helpline from this symbol and I can make use of a, a, an option draw helpline from this point. Then I will click at the edge of this wall. Okay, so this is the blind spot. To now edit this range area, I will select this and I will move this move node to where it intersects with the helpline. Okay, so this is the result. Now there is no range area at this blind spot. Let's remove the helpline. Okay, this is the result. Now let's insert another obstacle to this room to make another blind spot. I will make use of the function column to insert a rectangle profile. Okay. Now we of course have another blind spot. Let's analyze the same way. So I activate the helpline. I will start from the symbol and I use the option draw helpline from this point. So I will click on one side of the rectangle profile and I will make the same process to the other side. Okay. So this is the blind spot. Now to edit this range area once more, I will select this. And at this point, I will select the insert node and right mouse click to access the option insert node. So I start by this intersection with the helpline and then I will contour the rectangle profile. And then click again at the other intersection with the helpline. Now press enter and the blind spot uh, are now empty with no range area. Quite cool, isn't it? Would you like to see more videos like this? So subscribe to our channel and hit the bell. And what would you like to see next? Put it on your comment below and I can make a video for you. Cheers!